day and a half later, patch one, two, five. I've got a new line on, so I've got to be careful. First few casts, I don't get a damn great wind knot, so we just play it nice and steady. I haven't put loads of line on, I hate having loads of line on. So I end up getting a snag, I just cast it out carefully. We'll have a couple of casts and we'll see what we can find. Oh, it's lovely conditions today. Lovely little chop with that pachinko. First cast without a snag. Got the wind behind me. Oh. I'm down to the backing. I know how far I've got to cast now. I'm a bit of a cheapskate with line, I'm afraid. I hate filling my spool right up. I never really, really whack it out. But I've got the wind behind me today, so I've got to be a little bit careful. I'll just try and stay close. I've got a stonker on, guys. Absolute stonker. Whoa, he's pulling line. Absolute stonker. On the Super Spook Junior. This is a this is a nice big fish. I've got to play him well. This is a nice fish. Hammered it, absolutely hammered it. Ah, try and get this up tire. Stonked it. The Super Spook Junior, my go to lure before I haven't got the bugger in yet. Alright, he's going to have another run. Oh, it's a corker. What a fish. This is a big bass. This is a big bass, guys. This is a big bass. This might be my PB. Hell. Jesus! Oh my God. This is my PB. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that for a fish. Absolutely mulled it. Absolutely mulled it. That's my PB. <laughs> On the Super Spook Junior. Look at that, stuck right in his mush. He mulled it. Wow. Right, I'm just going to get my pliers and I'll get back to you. Ooh, I'm so excited. So this is a monster. Let's get the hook out. You can see it caught in there. Look at that, chaps. The size of it. I'm going to have to get a measurement. I'm going to get some. I'm going to take you off. And, uh, oh, this is just amazing. This is just amazing. The size of this thing. I've never caught a bass as big as this, ever. <laughs> I'm going to put you down. I'm going to carry you over here. Look at that. <laughs> that keeps on going. That's a monster. That is fish. That is a beauty. On the Spook Junior. The Spook Junior. Let me get my finger out of the way. The good old Spook Junior. 
Right, I'll get a couple of photos and then I'll be back. Let's get this beauty back in the water. Let's get it back in and away. That's, uh, I've taken a big measurement. I don't know what it is. That's a big brass. That is a big brass. Oh, we had a lovely big breath then. Oh, she wants to go. One look at it broadside before I put it back in. Come on, get your breath back. That's my biggest bass ever. What an absolute beauty. And that's there we go. Put it in the shallows and we'll watch it go off. I've got it by the tail. Here we go. Look, look at that. It's gone the wrong way, but we can have a good look at it before I turn her. Just let it recover. What a beauty. Look at that. Let's just watch it go. I'll follow it for a bit. <laughs> How can we bloody beat that, guys? How can we beat that? Only by getting another one. Spook Junior. I haven't used it in years. Used to be my go-to lure. The Head and Spook Junior does the business. I don't know what size it is. I'll tell you later. Let's get another one. Bloody ding-dongs. Blooming ding-dongs. Bloody hell. I'm still shaking. Let's get this baby, let's get another one. I've never ever had a fish like that. Never in my whole life. Good old Spook Junior. She's coming out again. Brilliant. Oh, what a day. I can't get one bigger than that, surely. I'm gonna have another half an hour and then I'm packing up because that's good enough for anybody, that fish. <laughs> 